Hello everyone, my name's Emily, and today we're going to do a paper towel and food coloring experiment. The materials needed for this experiment are five cups, it doesn't matter if it's glass, and four sheets of paper towels, and three food coloring colors, preferably yellow, red, and blue. So we're going to start off today by doing this really cool color with paper towel and water experiment. Take your paper towel and we're going to fold it in half first. So make sure you fold it directly in half like this way. Directly in half. Um, so like it's like hot dog style, you fold it like this, right? After you fold it in half, you want to fold it again in half. So make it really thin. So make sure um, you press it down to make it smooth. Okay, now we are going to fold this paper towel here in half like this. So let's fold it now. Fold it in half. Okay, once we have it folded in half, now let's put this aside. You need one, two, three, four, five. Make sure you line them uh, together. One, two, three, four, five cups. So it should be aligned like this, right? Now we're gonna pour some water. I have some water here. I have some water right here and I'm gonna pour it. Make sure you don't pour it in every single cup. You only can pour it in every other cup. So I'm gonna pour it in the first cup here, pour some water, just like halfway is fine. I have some water in that first cup. Now I'm gonna go on to the third cup. Don't put anything in this cup. We're just gonna put some water in this cup. Um, it doesn't have to be quite full around like halfway is good. And then in this last cup, I'm going to put some. Okay, now we have these five cups. Two do not have water, and then the other three do have water, right? So now let's take our food coloring. Um, it's best if you have three different colors, as I mentioned before. This is like a reddish pinkish and then this one's yellow and then blue. So if you don't have those colors, you can mix and match whatever colors you do have, but just put one color in each cup. So for the pink, I'm gonna put it in this first cup. I'm gonna open this, drop around like one to two drops here. One, two. So I have like around two drops in there. And then this is gonna be here, right? This color went in there. Now I'm going to use some yellow. I'm going to put this one in this water. Make sure you don't put anything in the other two cups. Um, let's drop two yellow drops. Oh, I just did three, but it's fine. It doesn't really matter. And then now our last one. Blue in this last cup with water. So we are going to drop some of this blue. One, two. Okay. Two drops is good enough for me. And then you have to make sure you like shake it around so it mixes. Or if you have some stirring rod of any sort, just make sure it's all stirred and um, evenly distributed. So I'm gonna sh shake this around and around until it's more evenly distributed. Or you can always use a stirring rod. I think I'm gonna go get a stirring rod to stir it. So I'm just gonna stir it, stir it to make sure all the color is um is evenly distributed stir some in here and then stir some in this last cup so you can tell that now we have three colors in these cups right okay now remember we folded our paper towels in the beginning right so now we want to put our paper towels um, like this. So we want to put them in the first and two cups, right? First and second cup, sorry. And then we're just going to put it in and then leave the second one in the second cup. Okay. And then we're going to do that with our second one here. 
and then make sure these paper towels are touching. And then, oh, we need one more paper towel actually, because we have um, more cups. Now we're gonna put this third one in this yellow one with the empty one, right? So make sure you put it in there. And let's put this last one into this last cup and this second cup. And make sure the paper towels in these empty cups are touching, see? They're touching together. So um, as you can see, we have to now, they're all dipped in, right? They're all dipped in, make sure the paper towels in the empty cups are touching. And as you see, the, uh, the color is slowly starting to come up onto the paper towel. Um, you can see, especially in the yellow one, it's coming up. You could tell it's coming up. And that's called color chromatography. And that's when like the color um, travels up through these paper towels. And then now we have to wait a little bit because it takes a while for this water to go up. And then if you think yours is not in enough, you could always push your um, colors in. After waiting about four to five hours, you could see the colors creep into the paper towels. And if you take out the paper towels, you could see the colors form the rainbow. And I hope you guys enjoyed this experiment. Hope to see you next time at our group lessons. Thank you.